Hey everybody, Mike Ross up here in Seattle, Washington. I'm going to show you how to reboot this uh, factory restore the Motorola Click. Alrighty, you got me a got me a couple of clicks here. Boom, see them both operating. All right, you can see the backgrounds on them. Not super shiny on this thing, but camera's not the best. But hey, it's built in uh, touch smart, so. Alrighty, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and take this other one here, take the first one and get it down, get that one shut down, while that one's shut down I'm going to show you, show you whatever he's talking about online, right, everybody online's going, everybody online takes this and is saying hit the menu button, get the settings button, and they're getting you in here and they're saying go to the SD, phone and card, phone and storage, right? And right at the bottom of that menu they're expecting to have they expect us to have some kind of a some kind of factory restore. I haven't seen one yet, so I don't know what the hell they're talking about, but anyway there you go, right? That doesn't have it, so I'll pop on here. I just shut this bad boy down. I'm gonna hold down the camera button. Then I'm gonna go ahead and tap the power button. I'm gonna hold the power button down until it vibrates and lights. Then I'm going to hold it for a second. I'm going to keep this, uh, I let go of that button and I actually hold the camera button, right? So then you let go and it tells you to. Now it says you got 10 seconds. I'm going to select uh, volume down, which is recovery mode, all right? So we'll give that one a second. While that's doing that, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to power this one down too, all right? Wait for this one to power down. We're going to come back up to this other phone. Boom. Our favorite triangle, ready? Recovery mode, right? Real simple. Slide the keypad open. Boom. Got it. We just do a little Alt W. See the logo? There you go. All right, little. Look at that little factory. It looks like a you know factory box camera coming out of it going to your phone. So there you go. It's rebooting right now. So we'll set that one aside. We got this other one off. I'm gonna turn this this one here's off. Boom. Hold down the camera button, little power button, like little power button. It's coming up. There you go. Release the camera button, right? Okay. There you go. You got 10 seconds. To select an option. Okay. Boom. Recovery. Volume down. I don't know. I'm saying boom. Just trying to be animated, I guess. All right. So that boy is coming. Give that a second. So there we go. Full of phones. All right, that one's ready to go. So we're gonna take that bad boy, fly it up on the keyboard, and then go Alt W. Same thing. There you go. Funny thing is that these must be a little different version because I don't remember the animated animated logo didn't show on the other one. All right, this guy's booting up can't really see that on the screen very well but hopefully you got to get the idea I'll turn around for you there you go T-Mobile so, alrighty these take a few minutes so Woo. so you can wait for these to reboot or you can turn the video off right now if you want alright I will show you these two when they reboot at least I'll show you one of the two I hope we'll make this video that long but that's um let's go ahead and uh hit cancel if you don't want to wait Am I ready this takes um, not too long, but a couple minutes. So we're doing okay here on time. Give this thing a second here. <clears throat> it's the typical reboot screen. Just takes a little bit of time. These phones have been around the block. They, uh, this bad boy's all cracked. Cracked. I think we took some Gorilla Glue and fixed it. My seven-year-old uses this phone, <laughs> so it's been around the block. But this other phone's actually in pretty decent shape. I think it's, we've, we've traded in once or twice, but we got the old battery swelling going on it. But these have taken a taken a beating for the last year and a half. But I tell you one thing about these phones is when you do the factory reboot, they're like they're like brand new. They just, they run like a champ, just like they were brand new. You get all that crap off those things. What do we have? Uh, at uh, 
you know, the mapping software, Ghost, I mean, the Ghost radar. Uh, the kids just put everything on them, you know, all the Furbies and all the all the different toys. So everybody loads that crap on them, and they really slow down. So, all right, we're almost done here. That's been a pretty good time, pretty good amount of time. Give me another second. Alrighty. Boom. First one's up. You can see it. Fresh and ready to go. Oh, that's ready to um, ready to hit the start button. You tap that start button right there. Got a dirty phone here. You tap that start button in order to scroll it up and get your turn to start hitting your enter buttons. Really is all you do. Boom. Checking for connectivity and going in. So there you go. That one's looking looking pretty darn good. There we go. Brand new settings. So I'm gonna take this bad boy and um, show you how this goes in real quick. Move down to existing account. Next. And check for some updates. successful. Bam, they are. There's our other one. The other one just came up too. So just tap start on that bad boy. Let's check for some updates. Boom. Oh, they gonna run just like it's brand new. Let me tell you, badass. <clears throat> we like you had it brand new, so I miss this. I like that. It's like it's like taking an old Dell machine and uh, do a factory restore. Then your computer, you know, only has one gig of RAM, but it runs like it's brand new. So it's a it's a great thing. So, anyways, there you go. Hope that helps you guys out. Good luck.